Also this morning, we're going to send it out to the side streets and see how they are looking at this hour. We have Deb American News is Megan Knight in North Baltimore and Megan Lynette's been talking about uh, the storm moving out of here for good, but not until later today. Yeah, I heard you and Ashley talking about this storm that just kind of keeps on lingering. Just when you think it's done, whoop, it comes right back around and hits us again. And uh, definitely seeing a little more accumulation on the ground here in North Baltimore than compared uh, to yesterday. So let's take a look at this uh, side street here. We're right off Roland Avenue, right next to the Enoch Pratt Free Library. And you can see uh, the road's not looking too bad. You can't see the bare pavement, but a plow did go by around uh, 5 o'clock or so. Uh, so kind of scraped a little bit more snow off there. And really, it's the side streets that are probably going to be the trickiest part of your commute this morning. Uh, if air comes back around here more towards Roland Avenue, you're going to see a lot more uh, bare pavement here, which is what I experienced coming down this way from uh, my house up near Lutherville Timonium this morning. 83 was in good shape. Charles Street not looking too bad. And as you can see, most of Roland Avenue is bare pavement there. And the crews have really been working around the clock since Sunday, some even even before that to make sure to pre treat the roads. And now they're treating and plowing the roads as well. And crews here in the city, you know, they've been going since 4 a.m. on Sunday again, starting with that pre treatment and now trying to clear the roads as much as possible. There are some 400 trucks out now, half of them focusing on the side streets, of course, also trying to pay close attention to the JFX and bridges as well. The director of the city's Department of Transportation asking for everyone's help to get these streets as cleared and safe as possible. We've been successful so far, but that does not mean that we can't, we have, we can't stay vigilant. The, the snow, the ice, any little, you know, one tenth of an inch of ice can really cause problems. So people need to still stay off the roads, be safe, stay home until the storm is completely over and the plows have had their chance to salt and, and treat all roads. Yes, yeah, some good advice there from the director of Baltimore City's DOT and something else to keep in mind. If you were looking to get a COVID-19 test today, not a vaccine, but a test, uh, just know that the Zeta Center over off Town Road, that is closed today for COVID-19 testing. But the Baltimore Convention Center is still open as of right now. It will open from 2 until 6 p.m. Uh, but of course, that could change depending on what the weather is going to do later today. So be checking the city's coronavirus website for updates about that. We're live in North Baltimore, Megan Knight, WMAR 2 News.